Underneath Tennessee's Smoky Mountains lies a natural wonder and a national asset. The Tuckaleke Caverns may be off the beaten path, but the caves sit atop a superhighway of sound. Sensors buried in their crevices that can detect seismic activity, including so underground like nuclear tests in North Korea. So just how long would it take for compression waves from a nuclear test to reach here? Maximum a few minutes for the waves to reach here and for it to show up on our, our data displays. The caves can hear waves crashing on the coast 500 miles away, earthquakes across the globe, and picked up North Korea's hydrogen bomb blast last September. The data then sent by satellite to the Comprehensive Nuclear Test Ban Treaty Organization in Vienna. The caverns are part of its global network of stations. The data that we get from the caverns is in a very quiet environment. It is like getting your ear right into the inside of the earth. Benjamin Venanda's family has owned the caverns for more than 50 years. After coming home from World War II, his grandfather decided to turn his former playground into a tourist attraction. But national security officials were also interested. Uh, well, the seismic station has been in here since the Cuban Missile Crisis and Cold War. So they've been monitoring it, you know, ever since then. Because the limestone is so dense and goes down thousands of feet, the caves are an acoustic wonder. While visitors weave their way through waterfalls. But you can drink this water. Uh, yes, yes, I have quite a bit and marvel at stalagmites reaching up 24 feet, it's what they don't see that might one day have the biggest impact. From these caves that cough up the Earth's seismic secrets, broadcasting sounds that some countries do not want heard. Hans Nichols, NBC News, Townsend, Tennessee. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.